five and this is amit here i'm going to provide you the marks versus percentile for second attempt of jay main that is april attempt complete analysis i have done and after that i'm going to provide you as you also know this year there is high requirement of marks is there to get a certain percentiles so i've considered everything and in next attempt you also know a little bit difficulty will increase and more importantly the number of students will increase and the competition will increase simultaneously so everything i have considered and thereafter i am providing you the mark versus percentile for all three type of paper hard moderate and easy what will be the marks requirement for 99 percentile if the paper will be hard or easy or moderate so everything i am going to discuss here so please try to watch the video up to the last so for 99.9 to 100 235 is required for hard paper for moderate 250 for easy 265 marks is required now if you talk about for 99.8 or more than that then 225 240 and 255 for hard moderate and easy paper now if you talk about for 99.6 or more than that 212 for hard 230 for moderate and 240 for easy for 99.4 or more than that percentile then 200 220 230 marks for hard moderate and easy paper now if you talk about for 99 to 99.4 then it is 185 195 and 250 basically it is for 99 percent time so hope you get my point uh, that is for every type of paper i am providing you the detail mark versus percentile so please try to subscribe this channel and if you want to get the same type of information in hindi language for each and every entrance exam please try to subscribe my hindi channel that is admission academy so now if you talk about 98.5 then 170 180 and 205 here you can check the difference of marks if the paper will be hard or easy that is 35 30 marks like this there will be a difference so even if you will get more marks you can get less percentile than your friends because of the difficulty level of the paper now if you talk about 198 then 160 170 195 for 97.5 to 98 150 160 185 marks here i would like to inform you about my complete mentorship and guidance program that is that will include je up to admission is done and other interest exam up to admission is done that is complete guidance and mentorship if you are looking for better percentile i will guide you for that to uh, so that you can get the better result in je as well as other interest exam also like bitsat comet k uh, vit manipal e triple e every type of interest exam i will guide you if you want you can contact me there is a nominal charge for that in the next section you will able to check the detail of my guidance so i friends here i will explain you about my complete mentorship and guidance program as i am providing it from last 5 6 year over 10000 students already have guided who are studying in top iit and it triple i private college of india so if you want you can enroll in my complete mentorship and guidance program for any type of entrance exam if you are doing for engineering each day i will be providing to you the daily basis mentorship how you need to study because it each entrance exam you need to prepare differently so if your goal is jee mains advance i will be focusing on that if your goal is all type of entrance exam i will be covering in that way so that you will have the good score in all type of entrance exam so that later you will decide which type of college you need to join now if you talk about 97.5 150 160 then 97 140 150 175 for 96 to 97 125 136 and 160 plus that is for hard moderate and easy paper for 95 plus then 115 126 150 For 93, 97, 108, 130. For 90, 83, 95, 115. For 85 percentile, 72, 85, 105 marks is required. Now, if we talk about 80 percentile, then 58, 73, 90, 75, 50, 61, 70, 470, for 70, 40, 45, and 58. That is for hard, moderate, and easy paper. And now, if we talk about 60 percentile, 33, 38, 48. For 50, 28, 33, 43. For 40, 22, 26, 35 marks marks is required. So this was about the mark versus percentile. Now I will discuss the J advanced cutoff. Percentile will remain same. If you have got this percentile in first attempt, you are qualified. But if you go for the marks, then it will change because of the difficulty and competition level. For general, 92 percentile most probably will be there. If you are under 93, then also you are safe. But if you are above 93, then you are 100 percent safe. So this year the percentile cutoff will change because of the increase in the number of students. So it is directly proportional. If the number of students will increase, percentile will increase. That is cutoff percentile. For that, 92 to 125 marks is required. 92 in case of hard paper, 125 in case of easy paper and if the paper will be moderate then you can take the average of both now if you talk about obc then 78 to 79 percentile will be uh, the cut off percentile and marks requirement for that will be 55 to 85 for ews 80 to 81 percentile and marks will be 60 to 92 sc 52 to 53 percentile marks requirement is 31 to 45 for st 45 to 46 percentile marks requirement will be uh, 25 to 40 
and for pwd nothing you just need to reach the center you are qualified for the advanced examination it is as simple as that if you have reached in first attempt it's okay if you couldn't reach the center in first attempt you can reach in second attempt and you can qualify for the j advanced examination so this was the complete information regarding the marks versus percentile related to second attempt of jms examination hope you find this information very useful for you so please try to subscribe the channel and if you find my guidance useful you can register with that also because that will help you a lot to select the best possible college and to get the best result in every entrance exam thank you